The magical feeling of match day and the desire to lose yourself in the moment, that's what today is all about. A meeting of two talented sides ready to go at it in front of a capacity crowd, not to mention the eyes of the wider football world. Stay tuned. All the action coming up next. And a warm welcome from North London. We're at the Emirates Stadium. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Arsenal, and they face Luton Town. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. He could pick out a teammate. Gabriel. It's with Erdogan. And a very good challenge. And so they start a 11 for Arsenal. Well, it's a 4-4-2, but it does look as though they're going to play a diamond in midfield. So it's important that they control that area of the pitch and dominate possession. They're also going to play with two up front, which certainly gives them a cutting edge. Now he must favour the cross. Timely intervention. This is how the visitors will set up today. Well, as you can see, the front two will mostly play together, but there will be times when they split, and that will then allow one of the midfield players to make oh, a Oh, the chance is on, Stewart! Oh, tremendous block. Well, it's always a delight to watch Bukayo Saka in action. We have that privilege today. Stuart, what do you expect to see from him? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out of situations, he can find that penetrative pass, and he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet and gets shots away. He could be the outstanding player today. takes aim and he's kept it out fully stretched somehow reaching it <laughs> and deciding to go short with this one Carlton Morris oh good defending to stop a decent looking attack Looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Just knocked it out of there. Declan Rice. Martinelli. Here's Havertz. Pressure applied. Can they make something of it? Stopped a certain goal. Lokonga. Isa Kabore. A very good tackle. Arsenal move it forward with purpose and control. Gabriel Jesus. Body in the way. This is a message for Owen Kennedy. Owen, happy birthday from your friend Jonathan Fish. And that is how to beat your opponent. And continues his run. Can he open them up here? Well, possibilities in the centre. That's effective pressure high up the pitch. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle.
Havertz. Adebayo. Is this the moment? And still a chance. On a time for composure on the ball. Bukayo Saka. Barkley. Lokonga. Arsenal have possession again. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. That's a good ball. And a good take under duress there. Kai Havertz. Promising attack, this. A good and fair challenge. Gabriel Jesus. And they need to get tighter here. A wilting under the pressure. And now they try to go forward. Bukayo Saka. It's with Erdogan. Ben White. Havertz. Rice. It has to be. And a goal to give them the lead. They have their reward. Well, here we can see it again, and he does so well to skip beyond the defender. It just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away. That's a really nice goal. And there it is, the referee's whistle. The first half has come to an end here in North London. On a more than satisfactory first half showing from Martin Odegaard, sum up his performance for us. Well, Derek, after a slow start where he was tightly marked, he got better and better as the first half went on, and he got his reward with that goal. I'm looking forward to his second half display. So back underway here into the second half. Now looking dangerous here. And he's made headway. Oh, that is a super save. Well, he had to finish that, but credit to the goalkeeper. That's a brilliant stop. And over it comes. Well, capable of a better clearance than that. Superbly read and executed. Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. Can they keep it going? Opportunity. Oh, a goal for Arsenal. It's theirs to lose now. Well, here's the replay. The pass over the top has just the right amount of pace on it. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. So underway once more. 2-0 the lead here. Barkley. Good use of advantage by the referee. Very quick thinking there.
Lokonga. And fine work from Arsenal to win it back. Nice looking pass. Declan Rice. Arsenal have given it away. Well, breaking at pace is always a possibility. Well, good run, this. Now, what can he do with it? Well, that's very good refereeing to let the play flow. Can he get one back? Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Well, good effective pressure. 30 minutes to go, then. And Kai Havertz. Havertz! Oh, denied by the post. And in the end, no damage done. Cabore. Lokonga. And options in the center. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Gabriel Jesus. Might it be Gabriel Jesus? Oh, yes! It's gone in! And now a chance for them to revel in the moment. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive, and the finish is clinical. It just makes it look so easy, doesn't it? So the game continues, and Arsenal cantering to victory now. Well, that's common sense refereeing to play advantage. Morris. Able to skip past his man. And a goal! He's put it away! A celebratory moment! Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So back underway, 3-1 the score. Coming off the pitch, number nine, and into the last 20 minutes. Number seven, Saka. A spot on with that challenge. Isa Kabore. Jordan Clark. Ogbeni. Could pull one back here. Well, the goalkeeper making a big contribution and denying him another one. Well, it's another chance for him. As you said, he looks so hungry for goals today. Number 30, Andres Townsend. So a personnel change then. So the corner played into the box. Goalkeeper's ball, it was always going to be that way. Regained possession. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. Is it going to be? Keeper getting the touch. 
Not a time for cool heads. Martin Odegaard. White. And tidy defensive play. Now, who can he play it to? Townsend. And he might be through here. It's still alive. Teammate and support. And eventually, goalkeeper's ball. Well, you can sense the relief amongst his teammates. But what a first save that was. And showing fine vision. Really good build-up, but no end product. Well, there's no getting away from it. Arsenal are cruising, Stuart. Yeah, clearly the better side. Obviously being fantastic up front, but it's their work ethic for me. They're just not happy unless they have the ball. And they're fighting to win it back whenever they do lose it. It's been a really great performance all round. Could reduce the deficit. Well, body in the way. Can they slot it home? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Townsend. He's trying to create something. Saka. Arsenal have given it away. Into the advanced position. And so that is that. The referee blows for full time. A victory for Arsenal. Well, Derek, it was fairly comfortable in the end because they were tactically superior, had better individuals and were always a threat going forward. It was a really good performance and a good result as well. Well, he kept asking questions, Martin Odegaard. What did you make of what you saw from him? Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat and he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was.